Hi, folks. It's Andrew with Top Fitness Strategies. Let me get my fancy dancy music going on here and uh, see if you guys can hear this or not. Let me see if I can hear it or not. Yeah, there it is. It's in the background. Okay. All right. Got a little bit of new production stuff going on here, and so I'll look at the camera in just a second here and see if I can turn up the music just slightly so you can hear it. There you go. Hey, I got it. I might as well use it, right? So, okay, so today what we're going to do, we're going to talk about change. Change yourself. Change your attitude. Uh, you can change your habits. You can change your appearance. You can change wherever you want to change in yourself. But you can't just, you can't do it by doing what you've always done. You have to do some sort of something to make, make yourself change. And why I thought about this today is I've been watching a lot of, Videos, reading a lot of different articles about uh, people lost weight, reshaped their body, developed muscles, so on and so forth. And the one common theme that all of them have, and and I've never heard this anywhere else, so and I, I put this in my own mind, is they got off the couch and they actually did something. Now, whether it was a good thing or a bad thing, they actually did something. But more importantly, um, they changed their eating habits. And I'm not talking about going on a specific diet. I'm not talking about uh, um, th things of that, the diet nature, okay? I'm just talking about changing your appearance by changing your habits, and especially your eating habits. One, your eating habits. Two, your workout habits. Now, I'm not going to tell you to go outside or go out to the gym and try to bench press, bench press a Buick. It's not what you need to do. What you need to do is, one, change your eating habits, and two, move your body. Once you start doing those two things, as long as your eating habits are changed in a good way, well, I guess you can change them in a bad ways and develop uh, a, a, a worse body than, than uh, what, you're, what, you're, what you're aiming for, okay? But uh, I'm always wanting to progress and go above and beyond where you currently, currently are, um, whatever that means to you, whether that means to grow more muscle, get uh, skinnier, um, gain more weight because some people want to go the opposite way, gain weight and then put on more muscle, things of that sort. But you got to do something to change. And by you continually doing what you've done in the past, you're not going to see the results. Uh, a good example is myself. I and, and I and I've said this several times. And I'll continue to say stuff like this. I'm a Mountain Dew alcoholic. Love me, my Mountain Dew. Don't drink drink nearly as much as I used to. I've cut way back. But I love the taste of Mountain Dew, and it's probably, yes, I'll admit, probably the worst soft drink you can have. I like it. Simple as that. Can I give it up? Have I given it up? Sure, I've given it up for uh, 30, 40, 50, 60 days at a time. Sure, I have. Um, but I wanted about, once again, I enjoy the taste of it. It's just, it's just something that, that I like. Now, uh, will I see results that I'm looking for in the change of my body because I consume Mountain Dew? No. All right. Now, back 20, 25, 30 years ago, absolutely. Because my buddies and I, uh, you'd go to the gym and you'd see the trash can full of Mountain Dew. Simple as that. Bottles, cans, what have you. And we had a, a big V coming out of your body. Your back was out to there. Your arms were out to here and things of that sort. But once again, we were 21, 22, 25 years old, something like that. And most people that worked out at, at that age can pretty much say the same thing. Now, as we get older, 50 plus, 55 plus, things of that sort, not so much. You start consuming the stuff that we did back when we were that young, our bodies just don't react to it as much. And I wouldn't say case in point, but uh, the case in point, you can, you can see any day, you could look at your, your, your buddies you used to hang out with, what they were then compared to now. There's, there's a multitude of, uh, of ways you can check and see if it still works for you or not. But uh, I look in the mirror for one, it's just that simple. But the, the thing is, you have to decide to change. Once you decide to make the change, and whether to change your eating habits, your workout habits, your attitude, anything, you're going to see some results. Um, are they the results you want to see? I don't know. depends on what your results are. But the only way you're going to get those results is to change something. I know I'm, 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 I'm talking, I'm beating a dead horse here. But that's just the way it is, folks. You have to want, want to see the results. You got to do the change. And let's see here. Is that what I want to talk about today? Yeah, pretty much. That's what I want to talk about today. Um, and also, once again, I wanted to, uh, you know, do the 
and uh, the, the music thing, the music thing in the background. So, hey, if you're still here, let me turn this up just a tad. If you're still here, which you should be, if you're listening to this, you are still here. Click the subscribe button, right? and also go to the website topfitnessstrategies.com and join the Q and A newsletter over there. You provide the Q, I provide the A. Some questions, answers, and, 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 and only a way that I can do it and to entertain you guys and to come across um, in, in, in a common sense type of math. Okay, so that's it. So I'll stop right here. Let the music play out, and, and I look forward to seeing you guys in the future. Subscribe once again and try to post a new video every Tuesday and maybe throughout the week as well. So that's it. So until next time, this is Andrew Top Fitness Strategies. Ciao.